Um, I'm Sagar, I'm from Nepal, and I'm a founder of Sanosunsa Initiative. I founded Sanosunsa Initiative 10 years ago, when I was 10 years old, uh, to educate people about climate crisis, because I saw mountains were melting, and like I live in the foothills of mountains, and two, mil two billion people depend on the fresh water and resources from the mountains, and I know this is going, like climate change is going to impact lives of all those two billion people. So I thought education is one of the key goals in solving climate crisis. Last year, when we were meet, when youth like me were meeting in a youth summit in Tuching, Germany, we came up with an idea. Like our leaders, they're talking, 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 but not doing the homework. So we, we children, we decided we're not go, we're not going to school and not doing our homework. On the first day of COP21, that's that was yesterday, November 30th. Instead, instead of going to a school and not doing our homework, we we thought something great, something even important than just our homework. That was the homework of solving the climate crisis. And students all over the world, in over 70 countries, they joined us in supporting the three-point plans of climate strike. The first plan was no more digging. The coal and oil, just keep it in the ground, no more digging. The second was 100% transition to clean energy. We know that just a transition to clean energy is not like okay, because like when all these countries are digging more, oil, more and more oil, we can't reduce our emissions. And we have a limited number, like number limited tons of emission that we can emit to limit the degrees, like limit the rise in temperature by two degrees. And the third is, since we already have impacts of climate change seen all over the world, there are lots of climate refugees going to be around the world. So we demand the leaders from all over the world to have a concrete plan to solve the problem of climate refugees and help support them, not only climate refugees, but all those people who are impacted by climate change. And you brought your protest here to Paris as well to put pressure on the leaders. And that was yesterday, right? Yes. Yesterday we had a local uh, climate strike event in Paris. You can, you can check our Facebook and Twitter and use hashtag climate strike. Uh, you can find people all over the world showing their hands with climate strike sign and supporting climate strike action plans. They, they were talking with us in Hangouts, in Skype, and they were doing so many actions like presentations. They were meeting their mayors, meeting their state heads, telling them climate change is, is really important and they have to do their homework on climate crisis. Great. Thank you very Thank much. You.